it's saturday and that means soup and we are making goat head soup aka manish water so the first thing i did was go into my butchers and i got some tripe some goat tripe and goat head and they cut it up for me into small pieces i took that home got everything all washed with some vinegar and some lime and i put some water on to boil while the water was boiling i washed my tripe and my goat head you could use um goat foot too but i just bought what i bought i used a squeeze of lime some cold water and some vinegar and i washed that well you can see the color of the water i rinsed that off some more and i put it to the side then i got about four garlic cloves and a piece of pumpkin and i cut these up into chunks the um, garlic i didn't cut up but the pumpkin i did got that peeled and clean cut into chunks and then what i did is i added my meat to my hot boiling water added in my garlic added in some pimento and added in a crushed up um bouillon chicken cube and my pumpkin and i stirred that and i let that cook um then i made my dumpling and i set this aside it's just flour cornmeal water and salt and i sat that underneath a damp cloth and i checked my meat that's gonna take a while so i went back over and i cleaned up my ground provisions my vegetables my yam my carrot my thyme you know i got it all washed and then what i did is i set this aside once the meat was soft in the pot it took about two hours because i do not have a pressure cooker i added in my yam i added my carrots i added in my garlic again we need more garlic i added in some thyme and i, I give that a good stir then what i did is i added in my spring onion so i cut the top and bottom off and i give it a good like twist and mash it up in my hands added that into the pot and i added in some more water actually some more hot water from the kettle then i made my dumpling and i added these to the pot too and i let that cook for a further 20 minutes when this bubbled up again i went back and i added in my ram goat soup mix and i put it in through a strainer because i don't like these noodles then i seasoned my pot with all my favorite seasonings um that was three different types of all pepper seasoning and then i added one pepper and i crushed it lastly i added in my green banana which was washed and left the skin on cut that up into the same size rounds and i let that cook down some more and this soup was amazing you don't want this soup to be thick because it's not goat soup it's manish water it's what what i'm joking i'm taking the piss guys it's just it's meant to be quite a thin broth and then you just got everything in there look it's even got the teeth from the goat honestly i didn't even expect that one to be in there and then i served up in a bowl and it was delicious i promise you this is something you should really try if you've never tried to make soup it's not as hard as you think to make and i served it in a bowl and i sat at the table and i ate every single thing out of that plate and it was delicious try it i promise